So, so the thing is that we need the collaboration of parents to ensure that the awards actually come to school and behave as students. You know, when they are given school fees, they pay. And the parents will request that we send back the, the, the proof of payment. Hmm. And not just leave them there because they're going to school. No, and, uh, you, know, you, you give money to your, your child, your child goes to school, whether the child is doing well, whether the child has been school fees, whether the child is in good standing, you don't know, you don't care. And then there was a parent who came here about, uh, I think last year, uh, last two years, coming to attend the child's graduation, only to realize that the child was still in second year. Wow. And that, that parent collapsed. The parent collapsed? I'm telling you. In the, in the office of the Dean of Cement, we have to call the ambulance to resuscitate that day. And so when you sit down for four years and you don't know what your child is doing, these are the kind of shock you receive. A parent arrived at the university to attend the graduation of his ward. Yes. And only to find out that he's in level 200. Yes. Because he has been in school for four years. So for he, four years. So the parent thinks that he is graduating. Yes. And he actually gave all indication to the parent that she was part of the, gra the graduation uh, uh, the college batch for that particular year. And she, she sent graduation pictures and all that. Ah, the, the asset, it, 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 let me also tell you something. Somebody came and they said, oh, I need to take the graduation picture. So please, you, you want to bring down from the college so that you can take graduation picture. Where that person has actually not graduated. Hey. This is serious, though. A lot of things are happening, and parents, you know, uh, for me, this is an eye-opener. I want parents, Ghanaian parents, to listen carefully. Whatever your student is, whether it's the University of Ghana, Cape Coast University, coming from University of Science and Technology, please follow up. Make sure you are you are in touch with someone. At least, we have mentors. We have mentors. Every, every school student has a mentor. Find out who the mentor is, or they have the head of the department. Find out. The office of the dean of students is there. When you come there, we are able to go into the system and give you the record of your child, the performance and everything. If he's not doing well, you know. If he's doing well, we know. Wow. There are, there are students who have uh, engaged in all kind of illegal things. They are suspended, they are restricted. They don't tell their parents. They hang around. They continue to collect school fees. While on suspension. Because their parents I am know. telling you. Definitely doesn't know because they provide wrong uh, addresses, wrong telephone numbers. Because see, after, let me tell you something. We have received a lot of text messages from parents. We have received a lot of audio messages from even pastors of those, some of the parents, uh, some of the students who have actually mobilized resources to support these students. They have even consumed those kind of money. The pastors give them the church money to pay their fees, and they've consumed Yes, some of them have consumed it. Hey. Wow. What your own friend and mentor. If you say, okay, you have not, you have not, uh, you don't want to pay school fees, you have not violated any, any code of the investment. And so you have decided to drop out. I see. When the son, you've extended the uh, grace period for those who haven't paid. We haven't extended the grace period. What we have done is that we give special dispensation to those who have money to pay. Okay. What does this mean? Please explain. It, it, it means that once you pay, you, we, we will take measures to reinstate you and then you continue your study. Okay. But, but if you don't pay, it means that uh, you don't want you are not willing to continue the school. 